I nominated Roshni um, for the Dignity and Respect Awards because to me she is the epitome of dignity and respect because I feel that's what she gives to all her service users. We had a daughter who passed away sadly last year. Um, her name was uh, Brigis Nasheen Khan. We often talk about um, Roshni and, and the kind of care that she gave. Um, my nan, Winifred Chaffee, came into Hampton Hall a couple of years ago. Um, she was a very aggressive person because she was frightened. She would hit out at people. She wouldn't have showers, personal care, and you know she would have falls and would bruise herself. And obviously it was a worry for me and my sister coming in and, and seeing certain things, you know, that had happened. And we used to go home worried sick. We used to spend so much time here, we might as well have moved our beds in, really. Um, and then Roshni came along. In my first day, I report on incident report nearly four or five. My first day, because he's beat to other resident for staff, one day she was beat on one of Elizabeth. She just walking and suddenly tried to punch her head. Then after nearly one month, more than one or two months, no incident report. Now she is good. Because of she more confident or oh, someone with me, someone is look after her. And her face lights up, doesn't yeah. it? When Roshni, when Roshni yeah, walks, in, walks in. And she has just made my nan such a different person. We always not thinking, oh, see, it's, the, it's my job, it's just my job, is care plan. She want to stay in home and just look after her, that's it. It's, but I thinking like uh, me, when I'm here, what I feel, what I want. So, oh, when it's so nice weather, sometimes I feel oh, nice weather, let's go to park, let's go to town center for shopping. So I try to give into some social life, if there ever was an angel to came look after our daughter, that was Roshni.